Good morning, I am inside my garage. This is my Tesla Model Y. I also have a uh, Tesla Model 3 right there. And uh, one of the most popular questions amongst new owners of Tesla is uh, whether they have to keep the car plugged in at all times. And the answer is a very simple yes. It doesn't really matter if the battery is full of charge or not. When the car is plugged in like this, this is my plug, the charger in the car, this is by the way the EVSE or charging connector, the charger that is built into the car, there's a logic there that when the incoming electricity or current is received, it knows when to charge the battery. So it means that even if you plug you keep the car plugged in it doesn't necessarily mean that the car is being charged uh in my case here let me show you here i am in charge to, uh, i am inside the car right now and as you can see here it says here charging complete meaning even if the electricity is coming in to the charger of the car there really is no current being used to charge the battery in the car. See, there's electricity coming in here, about 200 and, you know, 240. Um, there is no charging that's going on here. All it does is it connects to the, the, the onboard charger of the car is getting electricity from the EVSE or you know the wall connector or your uh, travel connector this by the way is my wall connector I also have the Tesla branded one uh, that is plugged into um, a 110 volt outlet because I have my other Tesla uh, connected all um, all this does is provides the 240 volt uh, power to the charger of the car that is on board so the point i'm trying to make in this video is it's okay to keep the car plugged in at all times especially if you go on vacation or you're going to be away from the car not using it for a while and you are not home it's okay to keep it plugged in because the car will decide when to charge and when not to charge um, so for example if you leave your car here you know in the garage for example and uh you know you've been away let's say uh, i don't know about uh, one week already or you're gonna be away from one week and then after three days the desired charge which is 67 percent in my case goes down to i don't know um 60 60 percent for example because it's been using the sentry um cameras because you've been monitoring the you know what's going on in the garage because by because i in my case here um i use the the cameras in the car to monitor what's inside my garage you know for example if there's um um if it's um um you know it's um some some activities going on um I cannot think of anything right now, but every once in a while I want to make sure that uh, my garage is okay or maybe, you know, the door got opened accidentally. Um, that eats up power from the uh, high voltage battery, which is under the car. Not the 12 volt, but the high voltage battery. That eats up power. So, um, the other thing is that, um, you know, if it's very hot in your garage and it's not temperature controlled or very cold, the car will automatically warm up the, the battery in order to keep it uh, in good health. So it also eats up its own power. Um, so um, the, the charging level that you're desiring to keep the, um, the large battery on uh, or at, is uh reduced so if that's the case then the onboard charger the logic of the uh, the onboard uh, charger right here in the car will automatically fill it up so there's a um um a drip 
or um, small charge that the car will do in order to maintain your battery level. So that's why it's important to have the car plugged in at all times, even if you're not using it or you're not going to be using it for an extended period of time. Now, it doesn't mean that uh, you cannot not leave the car. You cannot leave the car unplugged. Um, you can always leave it unplugged, but uh, if you if you are doing so, expect some charge in the high voltage battery to you know to go away to be used because the car has intelligence on its own to um, make sure that the health of the the car itself and the health of the the, the overall battery is uh, taken care of so uh, I hope that uh, clears up some you know owner new owners or you know prospective uh, new owners of uh, Tesla's um, doubt that you know some battery the battery will the high voltage battery will uh, lose some charge it's not a um, it's not a defect but it is a feature of the car because the car has intelligence to take care of, uh, you know, its uh, vital systems in order to keep it running um, smooth for a long, long time. So, uh, again, this video is about, uh, you know, what we call phantom drain or um, reduction of um, the uh, charging level of the high voltage battery of the Tesla. Sorry for the long video. Have a great day. Bye.